ABC 12 Highlight Zone, sponsored by Al Sarah Auto Plaza. Now, here's Jason Lewis. Welcome to the Highlight Zone. I'm your host, Jason Lewis. And believe it or not, we're already into the final stretch of the regular season. With three weeks left to go. Some local teams already have a shot to lock up league titles. That was the case in the Tri-Valley Central. And it's also where we find our Brandon Green for our Game of the Week. Well, Swan Valley eyeing its third league title in four years. Could the Vikings lock it up in Freeland tonight, Brennan? Yeah, Jason, that was just one of the many storylines coming into this game tonight. One that you may not know is that Freeland's quarterback coach, Kevin Lawson, was on the sidelines for Swan Valley last year and is now coaching for the Falcons. And he has brought over the spread offense, which saw the Falcons score 57 points against Birch Run last week. And they were hoping to do the same tonight against the Vikings. And both teams were also playing for the Mountain Trophy, which has made its home at Swan Valley for the past three years. In the second half, Falcons built a 14-6 lead, but the Vikings are on the move. They're inside the red zone, and Avery Golden soft, surveying, surveying, sees something that he likes. He throws it up, and Kyrie Harris has to adjust, but shakes the Freeland defender for the catch and the score. They would convert the two-point conversion, and we have a tie game. End of the third, it's a bird, it's a plane. No, it's Bryson Huckabee who puts on his cape and wheels his way into the end zone for the go-ahead score. Freeland would take a 21-14 lead into the fourth and Freeland they get a stop and they're on the move again in the fourth looking for the dagger Huckabee hits Jacob Kundinger for the first down looks like the Falcons are about to put this one away now Clay Kundinger he gets the handoff and somehow the ball is loose Swan Valley is the first one to get to it and they have some life one minute left in regulation ball and the game is in Golden Saw's hands he lobs it to the left but Falcons Carter Soups comes up with the huge interception that is game set match falcons take a knee and take home the mountain trophy 21 to 14. better than i can ever explain i mean i'm just so proud of our guys tonight we got it done and nobody believes i mean obviously we believe but we came out here and played really tough and we obviously came out the victorious that was our motivation through the game and we just wanted to be able to beat them once it's been gone for a long time. We've missed it, and these boys have worked hard, and I'm sure Swan Valley kids have worked hard too, but obviously a great fought game. Swan Valley down 14 nothing, and rallies back, but our kids just kept persevering and fighting through things and got away with the win. And with this win tonight, Freeland guarantees themselves a share of the Tri-Valley West title with Swan Valley, but they told me after the game they don't want to share. They could become the outright champs if they beat Bay City John Glenn in two weeks. Reporting for Freeland, I'm Brandon Green, ABC 12 Sports.